emotional response for what you're talking about because I'll say, no, actually three. And people were like, I do not believe it. I cannot believe you. I said, no, actually, we've counted it up. And so it's, it's the stubbornness of those kinds of beliefs as well, which I'm fascinated by. Yeah, I think so. That's a classic response where they obviously had quite an emotionally charged reaction to when these people were on. So they really remember that. And then so when they pull that from memory, it's like, they must have been on a lot. They must have been right, Because I remember the anger yep. or I remember the annoyance. Is that, is that what's going exactly, on there? Yeah. And then I guess you talk about this idea that with the internet, um, what we find is people seek views and seek information that matches their view. So that just strengthens that view and strengthens the, the extent to which they hold that and makes it easier for them to then push away and refute information. So you mentioned we talked about immigration. In Ipsos in the UK and Europe did a really interesting study where they confronted people with the actual figures on immigration. Actual so facts. they said, here's what you thought it was, here's what the actual facts are. Yeah. And what they found was that by and large most people refused to believe it. So they said, no, those government figures are wrong because they don't count illegal immigrants or they don't count this or they don't count that. Or they simply said, no, I'm right, your information's wrong, I don't believe you. Now, can I, 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 just one second, because I want to go straight to Peter Martin on this, because I remember, Peter, when you were working in a fact-checking unit, and I said to you, what was your experience of it? He said, the number one thing that shocked me is we kept coming up with exposing these big porkies, these, these big and, 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 and major kind of errors in what our politicians were saying. You'd expose it, and no one cared. And people well, just keep saying, saying it. it. Right. Yeah. So does this so does this hew to what you're hearing um, from David tonight in terms of misperception? Yes, it does. I guess it's that um, 